welcome to machine machine controller video series um, you see many controllers I have the same one similar I had to in my washing machine actually I had to replace three times the controller actually two times the third one third time I wanted to fix it myself and these three controllers are all are faulty some small fault there we need to detect that uh, and uh, why um, in case of an uh, emergency uh, how we can fix such kind of a controller with our own tools and components is the scope of, of today's video therefore uh, in case a fully automatic uh, washing machine did not operate due to the control failure we can fix it easily using our own home devices for example uh, you see there are four relays relay module which is uh, very cheap you can, you can get this is the relay module that i use to fix my washing machine due to the control failure um, there are four relays there and also there is a uh, i2c interface uh, to communicate with the uh, arduino uh, with this the i2c interface is can control these relays in a way what we want if you need an emergency fix emergency operation of the washing machine because you all know that if the washing machine at home is not working complaints come to you either we need to buy one or we need to fix it though i fix it two times this time i'm going to create my own controller to do that as an emergency fix uh, due to the corona outbreak we couldn't go to shops to buy um, i couldn't personally go to the shops to buy the control for the chase online due to the lockdown uh, <coughs> however we need to wash our clothes right to do that I created a control like this to start with uh, um, my setup is one Arduino and the four relays as I explained earlier I created a setup function within uh, Arduino ID, ID. This sketch helped me to get the washing machine up and running. Um, then in the setup machine, I start the I2C communication with the uh, correct registers uh, setting, and initial setup is done via this set of codes. After that, I define the four relays and these relays are the other things that I operate I'm going to operate and um, this is a simple flow of the program I'm saying what the comp complex like reading sensor readings like water level and the lead sensor those are all, all cut out and I try to implement quickly how we can operate a uh, washing machine uh, in case of emergency i have defined i defined some set of uh, delay, delays for wash how long it should uh, wash and rinse how long it should take and spin uh, the what the delay before the, to wait for the rinse and the in case of a uh, spin there are two delays i defined because uh, in case of when when we when we when the washing machine tries to start the first spin. It, it, it uh, rotates in a wavy mode, and if we continue to give the force uh, rotation at full speed, it will like to, there is a likelihood to damage the uh, container which is rotating. Therefore, I put two delays so that first start it starts uh, and continue till seven seconds, and there is a short pause of two, two seconds and after that it, it spin it rotates for the spin delay for 60 seconds after that uh, it stops the spin stops 
at 60 tons. And uh, in the, within the loop uh, function, I first stop all the all the uh, all the relays so that the washing machine states at the stop mode and it starts washing for 10 times and 10 rotation this means the um, 10 rotations to right and 10 rotations to left uh, left or clockwise and clockwise then after that it starts rinsing and stopping all the um, relays uh, and after rinsing it stop all the relays and start spinning and after that it stop all the relays and Exit. This is the first time wash only. This in case of emergency, we could fix it like this. If you look at the wash function, you will see just it transmits to uh, have relay switch on and switch off. This function with the delay for the given number of cycles, in this case it is 10. The 10 cycles it will start to first RL1 will. Rotate the rotate it to the right and RL2 it will rotate to the left. And after the after the delay and it will stop all and start rinsing, right? The rinsing mode in that case the it, uh, it gives the I2C transmission signal to relay three so that the relay three to operate in that case rinse starts. And after that interesting part is the spin. The spin should have two delays. First delay is to first start of the delay. Second one is to second uh, stop, short stop. After short stop it should spin again. Uh, that's why that stop is there. Uh, and uh, I hope uh, this gives a uh, good view on how the machine machine can be operated. Uh, in this kind of a uh, major situation. Thanks for uh, This is the Arduino. It is uh, used to open, do the entire program to uh, program is executing here. Uh, if you see this has uh, four wires connected like this. This is the I2C uh, connection to the uh, our relays. Four relays are there connected to the washing machine. And Let's see and operate it and see how it works. And I have switched on the audio mode and it starts uh, the relays. And you will see relays are operating in timely manner. And it stops the first relay and start the run in the right direction. Um, and if you see the washing machine, 